first look of her classroom kasi mag-face to face classes na this year. They renovated the classrooms for the convenience safety of our learners. Ready to take a look of your classroom? I'm so excited. You said sa una ma um the classroom ko. Yeah, ako na chance. Say, "Well, it's color yellow. It's like very color." Ito yung Lazarus Mansion. One is yung St. Thomas Aquinas Building. Dito naman located ang classroom. What are you doing there? I saw beautiful flowers. Raming nagtatanong kung open ang Angelicum School Iloilo. It's a yes! Yes, yes, yes! Open ang Angelicum School Iloilo. They are offering from levels preschool, kindergarten, elementary, high school, junior high school, and senior high school. The newly renovated classrooms were blessed by Rector Father Ang and his colleagues from University of Santo Tomas last week. And of course, our Father Besa, Father Castigador, and Father Lovell. Faculty and staff, students and parents. There, let's go. Anga Q marks. Oh, you have to stand there. Kanin kayo papaso. Wow. Wow. And dito may drop off point. What's that? Ito yung ating washing facilities. Tatlong washing areas. Oh, show them how to properly wash your hands. Before entering yung triage area ng school, learners and staff are going to wash their hands. Naks! And takikita niyo yung Q marks papunta doon sa triage area natin. Doon na yung assessment bago pumasok. Done? Yes. Oh, you go there. Where? Where's my? <laughs> Ayo, ogale na. Okay, I will show you. Pala, I forgot. Okay. Where is it? There is a TV. Do ari kadayata kay Claire. Para kadayata sa advertisement sa school. Angelicum School Iliilo Grade 1 si Claire. So ngayon mag-grade 2 na siya. But that level is YS3 sa Angelicum. So si Claire is YS3 San Lorenzo Ruiz. Meron tayong entrance and meron tayong exit. So that is part of the traffic flow. You have to close your eyes. No peeking, huh? You have to close your eyes. No peeking. One. Can you say about your classroom? This is the skeleton classroom. PK colors ang angelicum, blue and yellow. Papasok ang students and if lalabas sila, doon na sa exit door. Papasok. And then, lalabas. Yan. <laughs> yeah, so my armchair. It's an armchair. Bulletin boards. Yan. Oh, oh. 
Ito yung kanilang classroom layout. It's one meter apart. We have the entrance and exit for the traffic flow. And ito yung fire emergency evacuation plan. So, this is where we are. Here. Oh, ito yung clinic ni Nanay. Dito si Nanay sa clinic. Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. I'm right. I'm right. Yes, YS3 dira ka. Okay, it's an empty room. You know, it's a big empty room. Where do you want to sit? Here. Adira, why? Because I can't go to the Miss Eve. Si Miss Eve mo teacher. Yes. Uh, you want to sit sa front row? Yes, uh, I want to sit there, but I want to sit there. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. So my armchair, yeah. Eat, yeah. It's a huge blackboard. Oh, yes, correct. May lining para ma perfect nilang kanilang writing. Yes. Oh. What's this for? Yeah, for presentation ni teacher then. So it will be used this TV for audio visual presentation standby muna yung kanilang air conditioner so we are following yung health protocols by the DOH kailangan may good ventilation lang with ceiling fans the vision mission core values and graduate attributes ng Angelica Yes, oh, sa mga every room merong ganyan para ma-embrace ng mga students yung Angelicum community. Now, yung restroom. So clean after and turn off the tap. So meron silang guide to how to properly wash their hands. Yeah. Alex. Huh? Alex. Oh, you like this? <laughs> We're talking about in physical learning environment na classrooms. It's a good setup. I'll tell you why. You know, these bulletin boards nila ay designated lang sa back part. That is a good position in a classroom. And hindi siya over display yung classroom. Bulletin boards and wall displays are good source of learning. However, it could also be a source of distraction sa mga learners pag over na. So if I am a student or if I am the teacher, I should have enough space to room around. COVID protocol. They are maintaining the social distancing of our learners. Thank you. What can you say of the resort or classroom? Um, it's beautiful and I like it. It's a color. This is my favorite color. It's a bit strange. So are you excited to start the face-to-face -face class? Of course. I'm going to have to be a bit more. A bit more. part of the community and welcoming us dito sa Angelicum School in Luilo. So I will be part of the school clinic, your school nurse class. <laughs> and I will be handling a science class also grade 7. And Claire will be grade 2 here. So isang school lang. Grade 3? Grade 2? Why S3? Pero grade 2 ha? Okay. <laughs> so isang community lang kami ni Claire. So it's a whole new world for Nani and Claire. New adventure, new journey. 
we are going to share more about Angelica School in Ilo. Yes. And face to face learning. Yes. We'll meet your classmates. And Angelica School in Ilo will be having their new uniform also. We are going to share to you the new uniform. Huh? and telephone. We will just put all the details in the description box. Yeah. Thank you, Angelica.